Hello guys, welcome to another vlog. Sorry about my chapter to look, it's sort of bad, but don't worry, I'll be going away soon. Just need to stop looking my words, which I just did. But yeah, I'm going to do a little science experiment with the uh, baggy and the toothpicks. So yeah, let's get it. First, we're going to need a bag of water, which this is a one cup bag. See, one cup. A little bit more than one cup. Here you go. I chose three toothpicks. You can do as many as you want. And then you're gonna need some Vaseline. I'm using like this petroleum jelly, which will work as well. It's the same thing as Vaseline. Then what you're gonna do is you're gonna put some petroleum jelly, or I'm just gonna call it Vaseline, onto your finger. Onto your finger. Sorry about the awkward silence there. Is like really awkward. And you're gonna wanna take a toothpick and just like put it in between your fingers like this and just go like this. Now I'm doing this with a little bowl. You can do this over a sink if you want to. I honestly do not care, but if you do try this, take a picture of it and put it down in the comments, that'd be cool. I don't know people are actually doing this. So yeah. So it's a pretty easy one. It's a pretty cool one as well. You can call it magic if you want. But it's really science. I have just enough petroleum jelly. Or Vaseline. Whatever you want to call it. I don't care. Either one will work. I haven't done this before so. This is all the really no this is really the moment of truth. I'm gonna wipe off my finger. But yeah, so I have my plastic bag. By the way, it's supposed to be plastic. I'm doing it over a bowl. And then I'm going to take one of these toothpicks and stick it in. And then you should be able to take it right back out. Boom. Never tried this before and it's worked the first time. You can stick it in however you want. Honestly, it does not matter. Just try not to stick it back out. See, look, toothpick straight in. This is like really simple. Oh, crap. Okay, that will happen, which is why I'm over a bag. So, yeah, I'm not gonna put any more in. So, yeah, it's pretty cool. Toothpicks and bags. A lot of See, as you can tell, it is penetrating through the bag. It's going through both sides, no trickery. See, if I'm going to pull, pull it back out, which I'm not actually going to do. Okay, this one's leaking. We have a leak. See, look, that even shows you that it went through. So, yeah. It's really cool. I've never done this before. I believe if you do on do that, I like do that. It will dip. But yeah, this is just a little cool science experiment you can do at home, check your friends and your family. And yeah, quite cool. I like it. Again, my first time trying it. It's really cool. Yeah. So I'm gonna get like this all situated on what I'm gonna do with the bag and all these toothpicks. I'm sort of tired because I was jumping on a trampoline today and my neck hurt, sort of hurts. It's quite sore. It really hurts. But yeah. It's not gonna stop me. No, no it ain't. So yeah. See it comes in handy if for like a life hack or like to save your fish's pet fish's life. Because if you're coming home from the pet store, getting your new, brand new fish that costs like, I don't know, 25 cents maybe? Could be, I don't know. don't know how much fish co cost because I don't have one. And you have petroleum jelly, which is what I have, in your truck or car, or Vaseline. And there's a few holes in the bag, you could just take a little dab of it and smear it over the hole and it'll be fixed. So yeah, 
And the reason why you're able to go through it is because there's Vaseline on them, which is blocking up the hole, so that way water can't get through. Because basically this is oil, which, as you know, like, if you take vegetable oil and water, like, in a jar or a cup, put the vegetable oil, you put in water, then vegetable oil, the vegetable oil will float to the top. It's because water can't go through petroleum jelly or Vaseline, whatever, I don't, I don't know. It's same stuff, basically. So, yeah, it just stops the water from coming out, which I spilt some on my desk, but I can just clean that up. That's all part of being a YouTuber. YouTuber! So, yeah. I'm going to continue with, my, with the vlog. So, yeah. This is a annoying little alarm clock on school days. It is, like, really annoying. It sucks. So, yeah. And I carved pumpkins today. I'm going to show you some pictures of them. Mine's not as good as my mom and brother's. Because, basically, it's my first time ever carving a pumpkin. And I'm 11. Because the last time I carved a pumpkin, I didn't carve it. I just, like, traced where I wanted it to be carved. Well, I just drew out a pumpkin, actually. So, my brother carved his. I just, I just drew on it. Pretended like I could carve it. So, yeah. I've never actually carved a pumpkin. So, that's my first time ever carving a pumpkin. It's, it's fun. Took a while. The least fun part is getting it. It, it, it It's sticky. Because my pumpkin had all that cream of goodness. Cream. Cream. It's like cream corn. Just not corn. No, it tastes like corn. It tastes like pumpkin. Pumpkin. So yeah. I'm a pumpkin farmer. Oh, at least the goods, the pumpkins, some cream pumpkin guts. They taste so good. Good. They so good. Yeah. I've never tried it. I imagine that it's disgusting. So yeah, I'm just going to continue with my vlog after I clean up this little mess of mine. So yeah, and I'll see you then. Bye.